Hey, it's your boy Mike. Last year, you guys may have seen me on Facebook posting garbage videos, because as we know, we got a garbage problem here happening in Bayonne. You got litter on the streets, stuff blown all over the place. You got animals, raccoons pulling garbage out the bags. You know, you got garbage workers letting stuff fall out, bins in the street, so many different problems, and everybody's pointing fingers at each other. Everybody's blaming each other, but, but, last year, I made that 10 minute video, I'll link it in here, where I created a solution, you know, to this garbage problem. And what happened was a guy that actually works in the garbage department who does this every day, he called me out and he said, you don't know what it's like, be in my shoes for a day. Just do it, bet, you're gonna change your mind. So that's what I did. He called me out and at 5.30 a.m. the next day, I showed up and we picked up the garbage and we went to work. And afterwards, it was, it was an incredible experience. It changed my mind and we got it all on camera for you guys to see. Because after that experience, I realized you can't, point fingers because this problem goes a lot deeper than that so I'm gonna play this footage I want you guys to watch it yourself and make your own judgment and after you watch it comment below what do you think about it now has it changed your mind do you see the problem a lot deeper than it really is so just check it out it's gonna be worth it this is the real world raw footage as a sanitation worker here in Bayonne this is the real deal so check it out thanks for watching Yo, it's your boy Mike. Today's Friday, June 14th. It's like 4.30 in the morning. And today I volunteered to be a garbage man because right now in Bayonne we got a garbage problem. There's garbage everywhere. So I volunteered to be on the other side to see what happens, how it all goes down, and just get some perspective firsthand and see what the deal is. So I'm gonna be a garbage man all day and we are gonna document this journey and see what goes down. Mesita, how do you feel? Sleepy.
game like this is illegal. Oh, like this. We take gas. And anything with gas that go in the truck with other chemicals, it, it, it can start a fire. All right, all right. So we just take it inside or we just leave it right there? Leave it right there. Okay, give me a shot. My gloves ripped, so you know, there's a lot of glass, a lot of broken wooden. So, I'm gonna double up with these gloves, but it's you know, it's, it's definitely it's a lot of work, it's a lot of garbage. Right, I'm already feeling it. You got water splash, you got garbage splash. I'm already dirty, I don't even care anymore. I'm just like, I'm already just. So fast, fell down, twist my ankle, cut my fucking leg on the oh oh. Where are you from? Ecuador. Ecuador? Ah, Spanish. Oh yeah, where are you from? Colombia. Oh, Colombia? Si. Sí. What neighbors? Dime. Somos vecinos. Si, hace cuanto trabajas aquí? Siete años, pero antes oh. trabajaba en otra compañía. Ah, ¿y qué tal es recoger basura? Es duro, yo le ayudo a ellos. Yo no estoy dispuesto a bajarme, pero yo siempre me bajo, sino ah, que ahora estoy. Claro. ¿Y cuándo trabajas todo el día? A la hora que terminemos la sección. Ah. Hay veces demasiado. Hay veces está un poco light. Sí. Pero hay veces está muy heavy. ¿Cuánto más o menos? ¿Eh? ¿Cuánto se demora más o menos? Ocho, diez horas. Hay veces doce. Wow. Muchos logros quieren trabajar conmigo porque yo trabajo todo el tiempo. ¿Y a dónde tienen que encontrarse? ¿Eh? Para, a, ¿A dónde tienen que encontrarse para empezar? Tenemos en la yarda, yo siempre está mi ruta de ahí en la 16. Ah, y la cada cual tiene su, su, su sección. ¿Y o, o sea, recogen los camiones? Ah, oh, en la yarda está en Cuba. Ellos tienen diferentes yardas, tienen ah. como muchas yardas. Do it. What time do you wake up? I wake up at 
345. Anywhere from 345 to 4 o'clock. Wow. I'm out here at 435 o'clock in the morning. When they overfill a the can, it gets real heavy. With a cheap handle, it'll, it'll snap off. Everything goes except for construction work. Oh. No construction work, bricks, uh, sheet rock, things that come from construction. Hay diferentes lugares. Hay en Newark y hay depósito también. Yo, it's just ripped, so it's like. That's why it falls out, it's ripped, you know? Uh-huh. Yeah. That's why it sp spills, falls out everywhere. Hey Mike, you don't wipe your legs, man. All right, what do you need? I don't even care, I'll just keep all it off. I don't know what to do. 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 Yeah, I gotta walk off my ankle. I twisted it. Small little on these curves, I twisted my ankle on the curve. So, it's not Key thing is, if you're not hurt bad enough yeah, when you go, gotta go to the hospital, then you continue your job. He's not going to the hospital. And that's the good thing, what you're doing. You ain't give up. Uh, no. You ain't give up. Mad respect for these guys. It is straight up work. Closer to the curb, so it's easier for them to push it in. Hopefully, this this helps out. I'm trying to get closer to the curb. Little 
inside. This first no, one? no, no, that, that one, but not inside. The same one you did. Alright. Okay, cool. So now I'm gonna take all the other one. All right, so seven o'clock, it's only been, you know, an hour and a half, but I'm already exhausted. This has been brutal. I've twisted my ankle twice. I'm already all cut up and banged up. I'm just soaked in garbage. I'm already at the point where I just don't even give a no more. I'm just covered in garbage. You get garbage splashing all over you. You got to just keep it moving. This has definitely been a whole experience. So I'm going to get home, wash up, and then I'm going to talk about it. So stay tuned. Let me just go wash up because this is just, I'm, I got to take a shower. <laughs> 